Hey everyone, it's Maseko back again after only a couple hours. I've got it fairly tuned. I think I just need a little bit of fine fine tuning here or there. But basically, there you go. So it's got some finger holes in it. So it still needs to be sanded down. Now I'll explain to you about this um, kind of shiny finish it has right now before being fired. It looks nice if it could stay like that. Unfortunately, when it's fired, that kind of shininess goes away. But it's hard to it really explain. To get this kind of finish pre firing, after you make the ocarina, if it's still wet, only well, not wet but fairly damp, if you take the back of your fingernail or thumbnail, not the sharp edge of it, but the soft, or not soft, but the smooth edge of it, and just smooth the clay out with it. That's what I do, is I just rub it down and I smooth it all out. If you can avoid leaving any lines behind, if you get it fired that way without sanding it, when it comes back, it's really, really smooth. And after you paint it, the paint applies great and it just feels really nice. It's a really nice, smooth feel to it. As uh, compared to when you sand it down and have it fired when you get it back, it still feels fairly a little bit not rough but a little bit porous more so than it does with this way it's just hard to uh, actually get all the lines out of it so anyways it's sounding pretty good how it is I think um, I'll play a little tune on it <laughs> So a little bit of a mistake in there, but you get the general idea. Oh, here. So it still needs a little bit of fine tuning, but basically, I think it's just about done. Now I wish I could leave it how it is, but I will have to sand it down to make the bottom nice and flat and even so it sits nice. Alright guys, tell me what you think, and yeah, get back to me. Take it easy, guys. See you later.